We all have things that we wish we'd known when we were younger. Here's three things that I wish I knew when I was 18. Number one is that everything wouldn't just fall into place when I became 18. It seemed like to me, at least leading up to 18 years old, that once you graduate high school, everything falls into place. You get a nice job or you go to school and everything is clear and it makes sense and you're on a good five year, three year, you know, eight year plan that's going to lead you to exactly where you want. It's going to be very neat and tidy and everything's going to turn out great. Maybe the last thing is actually true. Maybe it will turn out great. Number two is that I wish I knew that it was actually really okay not to live like an average 18 year old because I wasn't really an average 18 year old, not in the sense that I was somehow smarter or superior to other 18 year olds, but just that in, in one sense, I wasn't doing the things that 18 year olds did. Talk about partying, you know, lots of relationships, just this kind of YOLO mentality. It's kind of funny nowadays because that seems so old and, and gone. But I really, at that point, I, it would be nice for me to know that, you know, hey, it's okay that you're not doing this stuff. It's okay that you're living differently. It's okay that you're following God in those areas of your life. And, and if you're 18, I just want to let you know that that is okay. You can be at peace knowing that you're not missing out in any way. You're not um, you're wasting your uh, young years by not doing these things, by not partying, by not being hung over the next day. That's not something you need to experience and it's okay to live differently. The last thing that I wish I knew when I was 18 is that everything that is worth building and that is valuable takes time. When you talk about relationships, any worthwhile relationship that you want to foster, a friendship that you want to pour into, it takes time. You can't just expect a friendship to really be something that you appreciate and builds you up and really helps you in your life if you're not really um, building into it. It takes work. When I think about my ministry here, this YouTube online ministry, um, I wish at 18 years old, even though that was just the beginnings of it, I knew that, look, immediate success won't happen right away. Everything that is valuable takes time to build. And so this idea of faithfulness and this idea of just perseverance, I wish I really had a better grasp at that at that age. But even now, that's something I'm trying to learn nowadays. If you're 18 years old, if you're younger, I just want to let you know that even though it seems like a lot of people around you are hitting success quick, maybe they, you know, got in a great school and it just seems like this was a quick thing or maybe they got a great job and it's just being really great for them and you're kind of jealous I just want to let you know that in this life everything that is valuable everything that is worthwhile when we're talking about building into God's kingdom and living our lives for his glory it takes time whether it's in relationships whether it's in career whether it's in whatever you're doing it takes time I hope you were encouraged by this video and let me know in the comments down below um, what you think, if there's anything that you wish you could tell your 18 year old self or wish you knew when you were 18, um, I'd love to know. And uh, give this video a like if you enjoyed it and subscribe because I put out two videos a week on Mondays and Thursdays and you're not going to want to miss them. Hit the bell notification. I, this is the first time I've ever said that. Hit the bell notification if you're watching this video. This is a momentous time where you have heard me ask you to go to that bell notification and press it because then you'll be notified about when I post videos um, because sometimes it's all over the place. But anyway, thanks for watching and I'll uh, see you next time. Bye guys.